right, um, this is video vlog number three, and um, let's check the uh, Honda C1000 build, what it currently look like, and I'll show you guys what I have done, and um, yeah, let's check it out. Okay, so this is what my car currently look like. Um, the front end is removed uh, last week, and I sold my turbo kit uh, last week as well. Um, as I was removing the uh, manifold, uh, I found this uh, wire gapper. It's the uh, oil, uh, no, it's the Vitek um, solenoid wire. So I'll be changing that and um, rewiring that also. Um, even this uh, oil pressure sensor wire got burnt also, so I need to change that. So um, that's uh, that's one of the uh, problem when you are running a um, front mount manifold since the pipe run here next to the uh, Vitex solenoid well mostly top mount or oh, well, I mean front mount are gonna be like that so you need to uh, make sure you uh, you wrap this pretty good well I'm surprised though I mean I did the I did a foil um, heat wrap on it and it still got burnt so that manifold must have been uh, working way too hot to uh, burn that wire but anyway um, yeah so I'll be removing the uh, engine hopefully this week I'll be removing that deleting this cross member so um, you can see the whole engine thing in there and um, I'm probably gonna put a uh, maybe three inch uh, uh, pipe as a uh, cross member I'm going to go with the uh, bolt bolt on so I'm going to have to um use the uh, drill spot to uh install that uh pipe uh, cross member. Um also um I try to test fit my uh, tack radiator and uh, my intercooler together to go um inside in here so it will stay hidden. So you won't see it once once I put my uh, once I put my uh, cooling plate. So it, it will stay uh, tuck or hidden. But uh, I run into a problem, and um, this uh, I'm not sure if you can see this uh, this right here, the uh, radiator support or hood latch uh, support. You're gonna need to I'm gonna need to delete this to uh, fit uh, both of these intercoolers and tuck radiator together so um, I'll be deleting this also well um, just a heads up if you are deleting this you won't be able to run the um, OEM hood latch anymore so um, that's the uh, bad part if you delete this but uh, you can always run a, uh, a hood pin there's a, a quick release uh, mini latch now you can buy they are pretty neat you can uh, you can use that and um, they look nice also so I'll be uh, I'll be buying that and installing it so um, this is the current update of my Honda S2000 build all right thanks for watching thank you for watching um, make sure to subscribe and uh, follow me in my Instagram ak underscore s2 dope and uh, there's gonna be more videos coming in uh, make sure to uh, check my channel every once a week and I'll be uploading hopefully one or two videos a week and uh, we'll see what this s2000 build gonna be look like for next year alright guys thanks for watching bye